Hey there, folks. I'm Zerfall. I'm All Dragon. And welcome to Evo, the Tier of Evolution, where we're going to try to get a little smarter, especially since they made fun of us for not being so smart <laughs> in the last video. So let's see what happens when we go off the top of the chart here. And that just takes us back to Saltos. That took us to the right. But what happens if we do that again? That's one of the maximum ones now. Yeah, this is just pushing us further to the right, which is kind of what we want. It's kind of what we want, but we also kind of want to... So is, uh, maybe attack is the big deal. If attack is the largest one, it's just going to take you down. Let's, uh, real quick... Let's try the down one. I also going to take, like, oh, we don't have enough. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to load... ...file 2, and what happens if we just... ...go down on this one when we have enough? It was still just one to the right. Yeah, I think you need to have, like, a certain amount at a certain point. So I, I think what we want to do is figure out what is going to be best between Wisdom, because it, it's a lot of points to get into, uh, I'd say load back up. Oh, I'm going to. Okay. Um, so... I mean, Vitality is our lowest stat right now. Yeah, let's try going up Vitality, because... And, and just kind of like seeing which one is going to get us. That jump is big. Yeah, there we go. Let's see if we can get uh, another big jump like that. So if it jumps us two, we'll be back to uh, Ornithosaurus. I'm ready to do a little experimenting here. So it's not that much to go to the right again. Is yeah. it going to just be one? It's just one. Yeah, that is just one this time. So I'm just curious, though. Now what happens if we go up instead of to the right? Just to see... If it's any, um... Whoops. <laughs> now if we go up... That went left again. Okay, so the the wisdom is definitely not just like a straight up, you're always going to be going to the right yeah. thing. Um, it's much less predictable. Well, but now it's just pushing us left, which is weird. No, that pushed us down. Oh, that did push us down. Yeah. No, we don't want to. We don't want to do that yet. No. Do that. No. All right, so. I guess our safest bet. I, I think we just go uh, Vitality. Yeah. So we got a little bit of a boost by going back this way at first, but now we've got to do it a bunch. But it definitely every once in a while gives you something that when you do it, it um, gives you bigger boosts. Mythosaurus. And we definitely had better attacks when we were to our right. And I, I guess this makes me much more confident in our ability to, uh, later on when things look like they don't really connect together, um, figuring out how to jump around yeah. before we get locked in. Alright, we're at least back to being horny. <laughs> Can we push it one more? I mean, I think so. Still not the the highest of the bats here. Vinosaurus. Wait for the picture. Look at that picture. <laughs> I it's just got little, dentures. It's a little out of date. Twelve meters in length, carnivore. The sail on its back helped to regulate body heat. Had sharp, straight teeth and violently attacked other animals. Era inhabited late Cretaceous. Sounds like they might be good at biting. Too bad we're not going to stick around to them. <laughs> you will evolve into Kurosaurus. What do you think? Real thing? 
This character was made specifically for this game and doesn't exist. So, um, it's probably named for Hiroshi uh, uh, Yokokura, um, mm -hmm. who was a freelance writer who uh, um, was lead supervisor for Evo. We're going to become a Neonosaurus now. Which seems like it was perhaps also named after somebody. Mm hmm. This character was made specifically for this game and doesn't exist. But it has um, a sweet sprite when it's walking. Takashi Yoneda, uh, Enix game producer and director who is only interested in new and fresh projects. It is said that you've got to have endless amounts of energy to keep up with his bulldozer like forward momentum. <laughs> what will we work on next? <laughs> Stediosaurus? Fourteen to eighteen meters in length, herbivore. Primarily lived on the land, eating leaves. Our walking sprite does not quite match up with this. No. A plesiosaur that walked on four legs, era inhabited Middle Jurassic to Early Cretaceous. That's not accurate. It's a sauropod. Alright, let's get too much vitality and see what happens here. No, we're not quite there yet. Barosaurus? Ooh, Barosaurus. Uh, 23 to 27, 27 meters in length herbivore had a neck that was over twice as long as its body. No, oh, you can see that from the picture. Mm -hmm. Lived in herds and ate evergreen trees, living like a modern elephant. Era inhabited late Jurassic. That sounds like, uh, prickly. <laughs> Let's get a save. Here we go. A patasaur. Oh, okay, nope, nope. This is taking us uh, further up the chart. Yeah. Interesting. Okay, so things aren't quite as clear cut. 18 to 24 centimeters in length. Do we want to keep this? I mean, for now, I suppose we do. I'm going to put a little more into the deck. All right, so 18 to 24 oh, meters in length. Yeah. What? Nope. I'm just confu I was confused for a second by okay. myself. Uh, herbivore, a large four-legged dinosaur that formed and lived in herds on land. Ate leaves and branches all day. Era inhabited late Jurassic. Can use crush. Sweet. Nope. There's so many of these things going on now we're getting a bit of lag. So I can't just hold the button down to do things. All right, over here. Now here's where we're gonna throw on a save. <laughs> hey, what's up? Who are you? Do you wish for death? Hmm? You different. I discriminate against you. I mean, I am Golem. I defend Lunarian Grave. Well, that's convenient. We're grave robbers. <laughs> I defend Lunarian Signal. You friend of Lunarian. Well, yeah, one time we accidentally scared away some lizards, and so I guess so? Mm hmm yeah. One day you take vengeance on Lucifer. Well, that's a lot of pressure, bud. Yeah, yeah, I don't know. I waited someone like you to come. My mission over. I now go to my master. Gollum died on the way back to his home planet. The master does not like children. Oh god, it's Torgo Golem! I happy hap Oh, oh the yes, other dinosaurs just didn't realize how easy it is to uh Yeah, all they had to do is go back in time and save the uh um Lunarian. Yeah. My message started playing when you approached. Year, hash two, hash nine, hash four, hash three of the Moon Reckoning. Oh man, we're not even caught up to them yet. 
Here oh. we will be recorded. Here will be recorded the history of the peoples of the moon. Long ago, one named Lucifer came from the heavens. She gave to our ancestors the gift of wisdom. That's a lot of wings. I like how yeah, I like how many wings she has. Just seven wings there. Under Lucifer's direction, we valued wisdom and our culture developed in the pursuit of happiness. However, the civilization turned evil after a time, which began to gnaw at our planet like a worm. Uh, sorry, but your planet was a worm. <laughs> we were too overwhelmed by our new culture to stop the coming destruction. Then we realized Lucifer's teachers, uh, Lucifer's teachings weren't leading us to salvation, but our own destruction. We abandoned the moon and fled into space. We went to some planets in our solar system, others into the deep reaches of our galaxy. And we few came here to our sister planet. No, you uh, are our I, moon. I, I think mother planet is, is uh, more appropriate for a moon. Yep. To our scattered brethren, there is a future for us on this planet. Should you retrieve this signal, come to this planet and start anew. Don't repeat the mistakes of the past. Lastly, but the we... future refused to change. Yep. That's what, look, that's what they're sending out. A bunch of uh, <laughs> lavos. Lastly, we leave a message to the organism, organisms that will one day come to be prominent. The prominent life on this planet. Intelligence is a double-edged sword. Knowledge on one edge, destruction on the other. The message re continues to repeat itself like a signal calling out to distant comrades. But we're in a patasaurus. We're too stupid to know what that's all about. Well, I guess we should evolve intelligence. It sounds like it's a pretty sweet sword. I like swords. Can't go that way. Can't go that way, but it's not a good idea. And then back out. <laughs> nope, there's a uh, paddling pool right here. A little bit of healing. Let's stomp something. Oh, it's one of us! Oh, oh it has more hit points in it. Play dead! Let's try it. You fell to the ground playing dead. It came closer to check you out, confused. Its defenses were lowered. Oh, it did crush! Well, I, you can play at that game, buddy. Crush it with your massive body. 889! Oh my Here's lord! Here's the thing, though. Why don't they take damage when they crush us? Like we take No, they did. We crush them? He did. Oh, sweet. He did take damage. Oh, we're crushing it. <laughs> we're crushing it. Oh, this guy's really gonna get crushed. Oh, yeah. I feel like, though... <laughs> yeah, he might get horny at us. One more recover and then we're on our way to the crush needing. How dare you? Rammed its horn into our belly. Wow. I'll show you a special attack. 929 damage. This, this damage inflation is getting out of control. Yeah. His power level's over 9,000. Alright, you're getting crushed. Sure. No. Although I'm still not unconvinced that we might not. Uh... Uh, do you know what? I want to save up points for a little bit and just try going too far that direction. I feel like it might be something considering. Look at all these guys. Hey, friend. Whoa, we're not friends. Barosaurus. That's still a previous uh, tier, so. Yep. damage ourselves more by crushing the little body. <laughs> yeah, but we're crushing it. I think we I think we should crush it. I don't know 
know if it doesn't if it recovers again I'll do it, but I think we technically took less damage doing it that way. I really do wish that all of the creatures that were on the uh, level would be from the same era. Yeah. Like, it, it feels really weird to be seeing things that are... Uh, Evolution works in mysterious ways. You know, in the Permian, at the same time that you can become something from the Cretaceous. <laughs> they, they said specifically that sometimes your evolution will take you backwards. Yeah, apparently so. More so than they realized. Uh, we're gonna get horned. Not yeah, if I crush horned. him first. It wasn't enough. How unlucky! Oh, jeez. Ah, there's a pool right here. Yeah, no, I know. I just was, like, that was close. It was a lot of damage. Smart enough to stay away while we're in our paddling pool. I do love crushing it, though. Just absolutely crushing it. Crushing it with ease. How close are we to getting this here? Oh, we got it. Okay. Or do we? Maybe not quite. How unlucky. Ow! Oh! <laughs> what yeah, are you so doing? You see, it, it definitely took uh, um, damage, from damage there. Stop! Thank you for not having a special... Uh... Jesus. <laughs> On the upside, it is killing itself. That's true. I wonder if it can actually just die from crushing itself too much. There's probably a point at which it won't do that. I'm pretty sure we can crush ourselves to death on this guy. We well, yeah, but I'm pretty sure that the AI on that thing is is set that if it's this below a certain amount of hit points, it won't do it. Yeah. What if I bite him? Not nearly enough. Oh, wow. Yeah, no, that's, that sucks. Okay, now we definitely have enough. Let's heal up here. And just really hey. quick, we're gonna check if we can just evolve off the charts. It, it, it capped at one point at 500, now we're at 511. So I'm guessing that as we get higher, then the cap is also higher. Uh, nope, that's next to tier. All right, well, we don't want that. So I guess we wanna go left. Can't you hit no? Uh, you can, but not until... It won't tell you what you're going to become until after you uh, say yes. Oh, gotcha. Okay. Oh, that was not the right file. <laughs> That's also not the right file. That's also not the right file. That's the right file. All right, let's evolve here. The left to the left. Okay, yeah. Bararurus. This character was made specifically for this game and doesn't exist. There are so many sauropods that we could become. Why why make make up ones? Sediorurus. Hmm. Boo! Oh. This character was made specifically for this game and doesn't exist. It's the dinosaurs from Chrono Trigger. <laughs> it does kind of look like that, doesn't it? <laughs> It'll evolve in into Protoceratops. One point eight to two point four meters in length. Herbivore, a small ceratopsia that was the basis for Triceratops. Dug holes in the sand and laid eggs like a sea turtle. Era inhabited late Cretaceous. I mean, let's keep going. Yeah. Scolosaurus. Oh, this is the uh, 
curved spine dinosaur. Six meters in length, herbivore defended itself with its spiked tail and armored plates on its body. Lived in lowlands around deltas. Era inhabited late Cretaceous to unknown. Ooh. They could even be on your Earth right now. It's a ankylosaur. Soscosaurus. Ooh, sounds saucy. So saucy. This character was made specifically for this game and doesn't exist. <laughs> you will evolve into a Sauralophus. Not a para Sauralophus, though. 9 to 12 meters in length, herbivore, built nests and lived in herds around rivers and lakes. Gave food to its young. It was decently intelligent and social. Era inhabited late Cretaceous. Let's just keep going. We'll evolve into Camptosaurus. It's kind of campy. He's facing the other way from all the other ones. Lame. Five to nine. That's how, he's, how you know he's campy. Five to nine meters in length. Herbivore. Walked on four legs, but ran away from enemies on its hind legs. Its mouth and teeth were well adapted to eating plants. Era inhabited late Jurassic to early Cretaceous. Now, we could have a special attack with this. I don't know. This this thing doesn't always list special attacks, but uh, they did have thumb spikes. Let's, we can walk faster, too. Okay, so... Uh, here we go, eh? Oh. A dungeon of some... Interesting. Descript. I just gotta walk along the trees. We're climbing trees now, so we're obviously getting better at that. I would love to climb trees as a uh, sauropod. This is what the thumb spikes are for. Granted on female. My, you're going to climb the mountain without wings? Sounds tough. Good luck! Good luck. Be a shame if I just pushed you off. <laughs> Shortcut right there. See, look. That is just saying that I went the wrong way originally. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> well, not the wrong way, but a different way. Ah, oh, but this is a dead end. Okay. So they do want to make sure you see this person to get mocked. Yep. Stop mocking me! I will mock you all day, every day. Hey, where are you headed? If you're heading to the elders, if you're heading to the elders on the peak, tell them I said hi. <laughs> hey there, going to hear the elders' prophecies too? Guess what? We don't have teeth, even though Jurassic Park Three showed us with teeth. Oh man, he's real close. Yeah. And let me guess, this other way was just a dead end to keep us from. Yeah. Give us the uh, illusion of Gaia. Of, of, uh... <laughs> <laughs> oh my God! Hey, he what have is teeth. wrong? What is wrong with him? He's folded up. No, no, that's so wrong. <laughs> this is gonna haunt my dreams. And just who are you? Well, it doesn't really matter. Not to someone like me with little time remaining. Have you seen this body? <laughs> the Elder Pteranodon was on death's door at this very moment. I have a request. Could you listen to an old bird's final words, even though... You're <laughs> no, you're not a bird. I refuse. Push him off the cliff. I've foreseen our planet disappearing in the blink of an eye. And oh, you don't worry. A new one will be will replace it when, when they build that, that galactic superhighway. It's fine. <laughs> and yet no one will lend an ear to the prophecy of an old bird. Well, I'm using that as a Roman slang for, for people, not for the fact that I evolve into birds of the future. <laughs> That voice is hard, huh? 
I, I actually just breathed in at my own joke and choked on some saliva. <laughs> my request is that you go to the southern continent and tell Tyran of this prophecy. He is trading there. Tyran would believe my prophecy and tell everyone else. B please, pack. pack. The old Tyranodon quietly drew his last breath. <laughs> and then disappeared. We didn't get any G, Meet so we back don't... on the menu, boys! <laughs> hey, wait, no, go try talking to the other ones. Oh, yeah, hey, by anything. the way, your elder died, and we're the only one that he wanted to talk to. So he passed away. Our elder's prophecy were a bit over the top, so I didn't really listen to him. But now I feel like I should have believed him, because he died. No, no, no. Huh? The Elder? Oh. Ah, I see. Whatever. Duh, I'm still caught off guard by this. The Elder, finally. Only Terran could succeed the Elder. <laughs> Terran's terrible. He's a monster. Go eat him for us. Across the trees and down. I wonder if it's possible to have wings when you go there and get different dialogue. Uh, not according to what I'm seeing. Uh, there we go. Alright, well, why don't we call it a video here? Um, no, no. Save Evo. <laughs> uh, and next time we'll uh, maybe I'll grind a little bit before we come back next time. So we've got plenty of Evo points to play with, and then we can uh, search for this Tehran and see what they're all about. Indeed. See you later. See folks. you next time, everyone. Bye.